Celtic Park was full to the brim on Saturday for the home debut of Roy Keane, and there he is. Fans hoping that Keno and the rest of the boys would have a better result than the 2-1 loss versus Clyde last weekend. Early in the match, free kick for Celtic. It's Shinsuke Nakamura with this delivery. Wow, he picks the top right-hand corner on keeper Alan Combe. Goal in the third minute, the Japanese international's fourth SPL goal. A nicely taken free kick and well placed to that top corner. And Combe runs into the post trying to stop it. Later, more from Celtic. Stylian Petrov is tripped in the penalty area. PK opportunity is awarded to Celtic. And from there, Sean Maloney makes a 2-0 goal in the 16th. So Celtic were cruising right. Wrong. Other end, Kilmarnock with some pressure. Colin Nish inside the area. Passes it off, but is tackled in the process, and the referee points to the spot. Opportunity for Kille, and it wasn't Roy Keane that fouled, but Stephen McManus from the spot. Stephen Naismith beats Arthur Boruch, 2-1 goal in the 24th. Second half, Kilmarnock with the momentum. Naismith gets away from Keane, gives the ball to Gary Hay. He delivers the cross, and Daniel Invincible with the finish. Goal in the 51st. Invincible, the Aussie, with his third SPL goal, and the game was on again. Later, Celtic with a corner. Cole makes the initial save. It's not cleared out. Kino is stopped by the keeper. Ball's just sitting there. McManus boots it in. 3-2 Celtic, and you can bet that the keeper was not happy about this at all. This goal coming in the 53rd minute. Then Ross Wallace working down the left side. He would get away from the Kili defender. Sends in the tight cross. Masek Jurowski gets two chances at it, and he scores. Combe is now furious with the lack of support as the Polish international doesn't care. He scores on the 67th, and that's his fifth SPL goal. Celtic ensured Roy Keane's home debut would be better than his first game. That 